Hello, Jam Tony are here on commentary, and ladies and gentlemen, it is finally time for the three out of five falls match for the JTW World Heavyweight Championship. Joe Anthony versus JD Bailey. We've been waiting for this match since late last year. Anthony was beaten for the JTW Championship by JD Bailey. And we haven't seen JD Bailey come face to face with Joe Anthony ever since. It's only been taken in behind or in a tag match. Obviously both men were part of the tag team match. Both men injured still from that tag team match. JD Bailey not a hundred percent. Neither is Joe Anthony. But he's gonna have to do it. He agreed to this stipulation. This is gonna be hell for both men. Anthony just wants his title back and wants to put an end to J D Bailey. Now the rules of these three on out of five falls match are as follows. It's literally the first person to get three pinfalls wins. A potential five. And these two just starting off with strikes. They hate each other. These two bitter rivals and JD Bailey with the knee to the stomach. Pushing Anthony to the ground. Joe going to try and get back up to his feet. But JD Bailey kicks him in the back. Picking him up. Shot to the face. Oh, and onto the head. And one to the back. Anthony down onto one knee. JD Bailey getting him in the sleeper hold. He's got the arm as well. What's Anthony going to do? Snap mare rolls him over. Now Anthony's got a rest hold on. Side headlock on the ground. Grounding him. But JD Bailey head scissors him. Going to reverse this now into a cross arm bar. And he does. Gets the legs across. Just pulling Trying to hyperextend that elbow of Joe Anthony, but Anthony punches him and escapes. And a big old oh, kick to the face of JD Bailey. Now Anthony's on top with a ground and pound. Grounded punches by Anthony, just striking away at the face of Bailey and a big kick to the chest. And a kick to the side. And one to the side again. And another one. Anthony non stop kicks, just wants to punish JD Bailey as much as he possibly can to get that championship back and a low drop kick to the abdomen. And he's saying, come on. You think you're worthy. And JD Bailey getting up to his feet. Anthony giving him a chance. He wants to beat him the best way possible. Obviously, you can see. Oh, limited movement by JD Bailey. But no moving him. Close lines. Irish whip to Joe Anthony. And a big, oh, close line. Takes the challenger off of his feet. And JD Bailey with, oh, a kick to the ribs. That looked like it hurt. And a leg drop connected by JD Bailey to Joe Anthony. These two just want to absolutely destroy each other the whole time. And what's this? JD Bailey putting Anthony's elbow pad on. That's disrespectful as hell and a forearm. Right to the forehead of Joe Anthony. Knocking the challenger down. I would pin him, JD Bailey, but he's not going to. Bailey stalking him. What's he got in mind now? Anthony up to his feet. JD Bailey with a spear takes him down, cuts him in half. Anthony's down. Bailey trying to give himself a minute to recover, maybe get his breath back. Once again, these two. Both not 100% after that tag match. It took absolute hell and a kitchen sink. Knee to the stomach. Flips Anthony over his leg. Oh, and a low drop kick to the leg. Obviously, the, in the last Anthony's Open Challenge, Jack Sykes actually injured the left leg of Joe Anthony. And bow. JD Bailey may have been taking advantage of that, but a drop kick. What's he thinking now? Stomp. And another one. Three stomps. Picking Joe Anthony up to his feet. Anthony's staggering. And JD Bailey with a big urinagi connected. Anthony landed rough on the edge. On that metal. 
Bailey dra dragging him back into the ring. We got a pinfall attempt. One, two, and Anthony gets the shoulder up. And now, JD Bailey once again stalking the challenger. Spinebuster connected by Joe Anthony. What's the challenger thinking here? Intercontinental champion removing the elbow pad. We may be getting it again. Yes, we are. He's done it once before. Hopping over him. And Joe Anthony with the people's elbow connected to JD Bailey. And what a move by Anthony. Tribute to the rock. Cover him. One, two, and oh, Bailey just barely manages to get the shoulder up. About a quarter of a second left. And Anthony would have scored his first pinfall in this match. The first of three to win. Irish whip. No, into a clothesline. Just takes down JD Bailey. Stomp. What's Anthony thinking here? Oh no, Anthony's going for it. Swan top bomb, but JD Bailey rolled out of the way. Anthony landed back first in the center. Wow, that must have sucked. Pinfall attempt by JD Bailey taking advantage too, and Anthony kicks out. High risk, ladies and gents. It did not pay off for Joe Anthony. Now JD Bailey once again. Oh, he's calling for it. He's calling for his finisher. He's got him with a ripcord. Rainmaker connected by JD Bailey with a pinfall. One, two, kick out by Anthony just barely. The Rainmaker was the move that won JD Bailey the championship in the first place. You remember, he hit two on Joe Anthony. Anthony landed right on his upper neck. Anthony maybe trying to find out where he is. JD Bailey running in a V trigger connected by Joe Anthony. Anthony's down. Both men down. Try and make the pinfall, Joe. You may have stunned the champion. No. Instead, going to pick him up to his feet. Kick to the gut. Anthony bouncing. And here we go. Curb stomp. Oh, we haven't seen that in a long time. Curb stomp by Joe Anthony. Cover him. One, two. Three, Joe Anthony scores his first fall in this match. JD Bailey now at his disadvantage. He's got to score three pinfalls to win, whereas Joe only has to score two. Punches to the back of the head. Anthony going to take advantage straight away. Not giving him time to recover. Getting straight back under the attack. He wants to wrap this one up early. And a big DDT connected by Joe Anthony to JD Bailey. Anthony may be looking at his opponent thinking, what can I do now? Oh, attacking the foot. Oh, on the shin. The lower leg being attacked by Joe Anthony. He's got him with a foot. DDT connected. Anthony's leg is obviously can't be healed up completely. Maybe going to try and inflict the same amount of punishment on JD Bailey and a kick to the back. Anthony going to step over him. No, J.D. Bailey's got him in a roll-up. He's got him in a roll-up. One, two, three. J.D. Bailey scored his first fall here. Anthony can't believe it. J.D. Bailey's just... Oh, he's escaping. But Anthony... Anthony... John Anthony's following straight away on his pursuit. But no. J.D. Bailey with a shot to the head. Just wearing the challenger down. Grabbing him. And just tossing him into the ring post. And Anthony landed head first into that ring post. Oh, and a kick to the ribs. He's two on the ground now. It's much harder out here than it is on the inside. Bailey picking him up once again. Irish whip pulls him back. Clothesline. A rebound clothesline there. And now stomps repeatedly to the chest. Obviously, this is false count anywhere. No holds barred. Anthony with one punch. Going to try and get back in this match. And on a third punch. Backs up. V trigger connected by Anthony once again. JD Bailey's been knocked down. Anthony may have spotted something. What's he got? Oh no, Anthony's got that sledgehammer. John Anthony's got that sledgehammer in his hand and a big sledgehammer shot to the body of JD Bailey. And one to the chin. Bailey's still on his feet and a second one to the face just takes down JD Bailey. Pinfall attempt by John Anthony. One, two. Bailey gets the shoulder up. Somehow. These two absolutely despise each other. But the panda, what's this? The panda, just the, with a chair shot to the back. Well, what the hell is the panda doing here? Oh, he's doing take the L.
Get out of here! This is it! Why do you need to be here, Panda? I know it's no disqualification, but there's no reason for the Panda to be involved in this match. And oh my god, all the people attempt it! Ah! JD Belly scored his second fall in this match! What the hell just happened? What on earth just happened? The Panda just assisted JD Bailey. Oh, and JD Bailey's got that chair. He attacked Joe Anthony with the steel chair after his match with Jack Sykes, but Anthony catches him, and he's got the steel chair with a body shot. That's what you get. This is karma. Chair shot to the back by Joe Anthony. And now Anthony, oh, one chair shot, two chair shots, three chair shots to the ribs and the front of the body of JD Bailey. Cover one, two, three. Anthony scores his second fall. These two are at a draw now. The next pinfall wins. One pinfall left to go. They're even. They're at a tie. Getting back into the ring. JD Bailey still back here. Connected by JD Bailey. Taking him down. No pinfall attempt. JD Bailey with a big second time rainmaker. Connected by Giant to Joe Anthony. Slow on that pinfall attempt. One, two, and Anthony gets the shoulder up. Near fall after near fall in this match. These two are giving their body to it. Oh, Anthony's busted open. His mouth. Anthony's bleeding. Going for a close line. Ducks underneath. At world's end by Joe Anthony. Cover one, two, three. And Anthony is the new JTW World Heavyweight Champion, ladies and gents. What a match. True deserving champion, he beat JD Bailey three times in that match to become the JTW World Heavyweight and Intercontinental Champ. But you can see he's busted open. It all comes at a cost. Anthony is once again on top of JTW. He's got the big gold back. He's got the white strap over his shoulder. Anthony is the man once more. We hope you enjoyed, ladies and gents. Thanks for watching. Joe Anthony, how does it feel to have both your titles back? Oh, man, it feels incredible. That was a hell of a match, probably one of the hardest I've ever been in. And, you know, there was blood loss, there was chair shots, there was sledgehammer shots, you name it. But once again, that twat, JD Bailey, is no longer the world heavyweight champion. It is back on the shoulders of me, the rightful champion, the first champion, the man, Joe freaking Anthony. And there's so much more that I have to offer. Open challenge continues. JD Bailey's done. Close that chapter, let's move on. Ladies and gents, if you want some, come to my yard. Come and get some.